morning listeners uh, today um, we start a new episode of the podcast series of the noigentology uh, which is based on my book noigentology uh, a compendium of spiritual and wisdom teachings pointing out the timelessness of all phenomena and today we introduce uh, briefly uh, the subject of uh, liberation uh, which is not the dissolution into something greater So, uh, just to briefly introduce some spiritual and some religious teachings hold that liberation entails the dissolution of the individual in a greater dimension, uh, like a heaven or a greater self or a greater mind or a greater being. However, according to the highest wisdom teachings, this is not what actually happens, even if it might appear to be so from an outside, outside observer. Each individual mind, even if it is grasping at the self-identity and trapped within time, is already an unrecognized timeless mind of pure being, beyond one or many, and therefore, when grasping at the separate identities dissolves completely, it might appear from a hypothetical outside viewer that the mind of that sentient being has dissolved in a greater mind when in fact what has completely dissolved is the illusory identity of self-grasping of that individual mind of pure being and that sentient being as well so one as a as a self-grasping consciousness it dissolves into oneself as a timeless pure awareness like a dissolution of an illusion What remains is what was always there as the timeless ground of pure being of that individual consciousness and uh, which is now knowing itself to be so. So in a nutshell, nobody dissolves anywhere because every sentient being is timelessly the mind of pure being for that sentient being. And the only thing that is lacking is this complete self-recognition and the, the dissolution of the self-grasping identity at separate separateness so this is just a brief introduction uh, more information can be found in the book and uh, the link to the book in the comments and thank you for listening mm-hmm.